Oh, good magic moment. Oh, look at that. Perfect fit. Perfect fit. That's better than the one I've got. That's great. I'm back at Belsall Academy. It's my first time back since I left in 1985. It's obviously a long time ago. Just walking in the door, just incredible. You just walk up, see those big staircases, those big pillars. All these uh, experiences and emotions just come sort of flooding back, thinking about all the teachers here. Walk through the assembly hall. That assembly hall was Belsall Academy, like my band, when we were 16 play in the assembly hall at the school disco, which was out of this world. First time I'd ever been on a stage. Absolutely petrified, absolutely brilliant. Getting to walk around the, all the science areas, just fantastic. Talking to all these amazing students, these amazing pupils. You can see how much they're into it. They love science, they love doing these experiments. And so much of that comes from just these unbelievably brilliant teachers who are behind me. Just talking to them, I'm blown away by how much they care about sort of getting these kids up to speed about science, thinking about chemistry, thinking about going on to college and uni. That's absolutely wonderful. Today we met Professor McMillan and we discussed titrations. And I think it was amazing that someone from my school um, went off and won such an amazing prize and is so su successful in life. Meeting him today gave me so much more confidence that someone from my school can also go on and like, maybe I can be as successful maybe as him. I would like to go on hopefully to Strathclyde Uni and study pharmacology and biochemistry. Uh, I'm hoping to go on to study chemistry at Glasgow Uni um, and starting out at Bells Hill is the same kind of path that Professor McMillan went down. It was quite motivational to be in a similar direction as he was going on to win a Nobel Prize. Yeah, very grateful for Professor McMillan to take the time to come to the school and um, talk about how great the chemistry department is and um, I can say the same. Uh, after school I want to go to do pharmacology at Edinburgh Uni and it's a fantastic uh, opportunity for me to meet McMill David McMillan as um, he was talking about how his wife done uh, medicinal chemistry. So me going down the, the chemistry route that he did um, is very inspiring for me. I'm kind of in the same boat as his here. Um, I want to go to Edinburgh University as well to study pharmacology. I've been dead, dead lucky to win the Nobel Prize, and anybody who knows me will tell you that. But one of the sort of brilliant things that came with the Nobel Prize is they give you a reasonable amount of financial funding. And one of the things I was really fortunate to be able to do was to take that funding and that money and put it towards the May and Billy McMillan Foundation. So that is a fund that's been set up. It's going to grow and continue to fund uh, underprivileged kids in Scotland who are thinking about going to college and thinking about going to uni to sort of help them to just even think about uni in the first place and hopefully eventually get there, which is something we're all really proud to be part of. We're really excited about that.